This is my reaction to Yu-Gi-Oh! Season 2, Episode 47, Showdown in the Shadows, Part 1. So in the last episode, we got backstory on Ishizu and Merrick and their whole dynamic and how, I guess, Merrick became evil? Sort of, and I'm kind of confused about it, because I guess he was possessed by Yami Merrick, despite the fact he didn't even touch the rod yet. So that's weird. I, get, I don't know. I don't really fully understand that still. And then in present day... Taya, who was being controlled by real Merrick, gave the ring to Bakura to wake him up, and now real Merrick is inside Bakura as well, and evil Bakura got up and challenged Yami Merrick to a duel, and now they're dueling, and yeah. Also, if you like full and early added reactions to Yu-Gi-Oh! and other shows that I react to, you can join my Patreon, like all these lovely people. The support really does help me out and really means a lot. It makes it so I can keep making videos like these for you guys on a regular basis. So if you'd like to help join the support, the link that is down below. So yeah, let's go. Don't forget me, handsome. Okay? See you later. Oh. Let's just stay there, so. There will be no laughter once I've banished you to the shadow. So I'm assuming Bakura is losing, right? Like. Darkness. Wait and see. Once they discover I've changed most of the cards in my dueling deck. Ooh, clever. And don't think I'm unaware of the Egyptian god card you now hold. Just because that fool Marek is dueling on your side doesn't mean you're safe from the fury of Ra. For when I'm through with you two... You're both certain to end up in the dark. Before we start, there's someone here who would like to have a few words with you face to face. Is it real, Mary? Yeah. I will win my body back. She explained that after I received the Tomb Keeper's initiation, the seeds of your existence were planted. And it was you who began but how? towards darkness when you sent my father to the Shadow Realm. Soon you'll like, I thought it was an evil spirit in the rod. Without me, you won't exist. It oh. appears there are some secrets that Merrick has kept from me. Now, if he wants my help, it will cost him dearly. Just stand back and do as I say. Silence. There's business to discuss. For Is there a magic stronger than that of the seven millennium items that you haven't told me about? So I think the only thing we haven't seen was the scale of the millennial items, right? Is that the only one we haven't seen, like, in person? Or present day? I'll slowly devour the loser as his life points diminish. What do you mean? Oh, okay. Just wait and see. There's a Bakura's losing. Let's do it. Okay. I'll be honest, I, I don't really care much about this duel. One, I feel like it's very obvious Bakura's gonna lose. And also the fact that I feel like this is kind of pointless. It has nothing to do with the competition, nothing to do with, like, real lives on the line to actually give a shit about. So... I'm kind of just like, oh yeah, sure, oh, cool monster. Dead. A few of these episodes, I don't know how many parts this one is, but... Might just be me being like, oh yeah, cool. Like, oh look, he has drills! Fascinating. Oh, 500. Oh, we're not. Oh, wow. It's all pointless. <laughs> My magic card has eliminated your pathetic trap. It'll take more than a magic card to beat me. That may be true, but from the looks of your arm, it's a start. My arm? <laughs> oh. Oh, his arm's, like, fading away. Oh, that's kind of cool, actually. What have you done to my body? I will certainly prevail. Only fools rely on the help of the desperate. <laughs> Damn. Just wait, you'll see. Oh. And that's the door to Yami's side. Hmm. I've been in there once before, and it was really dangerous. But maybe I can find some clues to the ancient past. Whoa, talk about a complex mind. I don't remember seeing this many levels before. There are false starts and death. Really? Everywhere. I thought there was. Something wrong, Yugi? 
Sorry if I disturbed you. And the joke will be on you. Now then. It doesn't matter which card you play next. I know your deck very well, and none of your moves will surprise me. Remember, I yeah. witnessed your last duel. If he's familiar with my cards, he'll be expecting me to use my destiny board as I did last time. Mm. But I'm afraid he's in for a surprise. My trap card forces both players to discard their hands to the graveyard. Then oh. let's just draw five new cards from our decks. Of course, there is a downside to playing this card. The duelist who uses it loses 100 life points. Oh. Each card he throws away. You lost your other elbow. Now I shall sacrifice Kernia in order to summon my dreaded Puppet Master. Did Ooh. I mention my new monster's special ability? So I can then claim it for myself. Mm. <laughs> now enjoy it while you can, for soon it will be mine. Don't be so sure. I'm on to your plan, and I can assure you you'll fail. Your sad attempt to steal Ra was obvious. You laid it all out for me on the field, you fool. <laughs> it's all there. The three useless monsters you summoned for 1,000 life points. Mm. The face down card you're waiting to activate. As you wish, fool. Thank you. Good luck. Hmm. Now you pick a card. Any card. <laughs> Monster reborn should do. Smart. It must be quite hard to part with your That's with a safe bet. card, but don't feel bad. It may seem like you've just lost your Egyptian guard card, but I can promise that you will be seeing it again very soon. <laughs> don't get excited just yet. I think you're forgetting something. You can't control the power of Ra, which means the card is absolutely but useless to you. But wouldn't Braille Merrick be able to? The winged dragon of Ra, one more turn to go, and the winged dragon of Ra will cast you to the shadows. Hmm. I'm reacting to Yu-Gi-Oh! Season 2, Episode 47, Showdown in the Shadows, Part 1. So... Yami Merrick and Evil Bakura with real Merrick dueled. And yeah, they're dueling in Shadow Realm where every time they lose life points, it like I guess makes part of their body start disappearing, as we saw with Bakura. And like I said, I honestly don't really give a shit about this battle. I really don't. I, I really just don't care about about it. Like I know Bakura like has the winged dragon run and like, ooh, he's gonna use it. But like I still know Yami Merrick's probably gonna win because he's probably gonna be the big bad. And, yeah. So I'm kind of just like, eh, you know, that's, that's uh, whatever. So, yeah. That's it.